Hello, this is Anya with a message from the Rose, the Brothers of the Rose. We're always talking about the sacred divine feminine and how we need to nourish and acknowledge this energy within us to return to the divine goddess. But where does it leave our divine masculine energy? Remember, we are both. We carry both energies. Each of us does so. The problem we have really is that the divine masculine is totally out of whack. And we need to bring that energy which is inside of us into harmony with our divine feminine energy. When you bring both energies together, that is then when you will have wholeness, harmony and balance in your life. One is not better than the other. You have your Luna and you have your Sun, the Yin and Yang. It's all about the healing of these energies and the maturity. Remember we're learning about the wounding of the inner child. So we are the child, the teenager and the adult. And it all depends where we are at that moment in time, whether we are acting as the adult or the little child having a temper tantrum. So the brothers of the rose means to acknowledge the divine masculine energy within and around us. The divine masculine is that one of the protector, not the suppressor. It's about a support, not the coercion. It is about honour and not dishonour. In society is doing our men a huge disservice. But that's for another day. So today's message, the Brothers of the Rose, is encouraging us to embrace and heal our masculine divine energy within us, bringing it into balance and harmony with our divine feminine energy. And that's it for today. Bye for now.